something happened to me and I really dislike that it happened. What I find, it's like, I don't know, like demons or something that replays it in my head over and over again. It is very annoying. I don't really want to think about those things much, but as it seems, it replays in my mind whether I want it to or not. It is extremely annoying. I believe those thoughts are trying to get me to not forgive, to get me to hate and stay in anger. I don't want to be angry. I don't want to be hateful. I want to be able to move on and not have bad feelings for a particular person. What I have been noticing as well, it's like those thoughts are trying to make me feel like the victim. Yes, I have done wrong, but I don't want to feel like a victim. Because if you think about it, how will feeling like the victim help you? How will thinking about the bad things that happened to you help you? How will always reminding yourself of what happened, how can it help you? I don't want to think about those thoughts. But as it seems like, something very often, as it seems, pushes those thoughts to me so often. I don't like it. When those thoughts come to me, most of the time, I say to myself, I forgive that person. Even when they come to me often, I think most of the time, I say I forgive that person. We have to understand we are in a spiritual war. Some bad things may have happened to you. You may get very, you may get so many th thoughts about what happened. You may even feel bad about what happened. Give it over to God. Forgive that person and try to move on. Listen, in order for you to be forgiven, you need to forgive. Try not to replay in your mind that you are a victim. Like, why did this have to happen to me? Why this? Why that? Stop thinking or try to stop thinking about those things. Because how is it really going to help you? I guess you can think about what someone has done to you all day, every day. But how is that going to help you? Is that really going to make you feel better? I don't think so. Move on. Try to forgive. Say you love that person, even though you may not feel it. You may say, Kevin, that is lying. And in the sense I am speaking of it, it is not lying. If I am saying this right, I believe there is a verse that says death and life is in the power of the tongue. So you are speaking things forth, even though you may not feel it as of now. How can we have love for God when we have hate for another? We need to forgive even though it may hurt so badly. Forgive and move on. May God bless us.